What started out as a joke is apparently turning into a reality. We've got the dreaded front idler of a Voron Trident, which if you don't know, I've had some things to say about it. And the man, the myth, the legend, the beard, Mr. Steve Builds himself, Hello. is here to show me how much of an idiot I actually am. No, but I am gonna show you how to do this right. Because yeah, I, I, apparently I was doing everything but doing it right. Yeah. The way, so for those that didn't see the live stream, what I ended up doing was actually pulling the idler apart, running the belt through, then reattaching the idler and putting it back on. It took me like 30 seconds once I figured out how to do it. That is not the right way. And I'll show you the five second way. Yeah, yeah. Are you ready? Uh, it, it, I didn't struggle for like an hour, curse your name a few times. It was funny though. Yeah. It was funny. Do you want to try it or do you want me to just show you? It's gonna be easier for me to just yeah, show say, you. Yeah, show me it? first, then let me try okay. it. Okay, let's see how we can get this. So if you imagine this is the front of the printer, right? Okay. And your, your tool head is here, and then I'm going to just set this on the floor. The thing that chat was probably yelling at you repeatedly to do is remove the tension screw. Okay, completely. And you're coming from the tool head uh -huh. through this side. Yeah. Like this. Okay. Now back through, let's give a little Little bend. Yeah, a little bend so I can get little through the corner. They told me to use some sort of a zip tie thing. I'm like, I don't know what the heck you guys are trying to do to me. And it just. And it's done. And then you can oh, put no. your, your tension screw back in. Oh no. <laughs> in my defense, you you are partially responsible for this. I am. D is this idler your design? No. Okay. It is adapted from the um, one died aid in 2.4. Okay, I'm gonna pull the belt out so I can't cheat. Gotta take this out. Okay, belt goes in like that. In through the top hole. I guess I gotta, now, I gotta bend it up a little bit to yep. get it to come out, okay. Yep. And, a, and a quick trick if it doesn't. Uh -huh. So I'll go there and then just kind of wiggle it. If it doesn't, take the screw. And take put the it screw in there and, and just kinda, yep, yep, okay. There you go. All right. You know, the soldier wasn't standing at attention there. It happens to some of us, okay? All right. Occasionally, Yeah. to some, not me. So then I gotta bend it, <laughs> gotta bend it like this. Yeah, this is gonna be great if you're not watching this, <laughs> if you're just listening in the background. But I feed it down. <laughs> Good job. Come on, you gotta see. <laughs> So this was a joke. It just started as a joke. I said, ah, oh, Steve, man, you, sh you should bring this so, so I can struggle and you can teach me how to do it. And what did Steve actually do? He made the parts, brought some extrusions so I could learn how to do this. That is a lot easier now you're an expert. than how I did it. Oh, man. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> <laughs> Steve, this is, yeah, all right, fine, fine. Fine, fine. Do you take back all the bad things you said about me? Only some of them. Okay. <laughs> you do have the best beard in the industry. Well, thank you. Although, are you Steve Builds or are you Ethan? I'm not Ethan. You're not Ethan, okay. Yeah. Okay, all right, all right. I've done it once, oh. Okay, I've done it once. It's a speed run now. Let's do a race. A race? You do it and then I'll do it. This isn't or fair. Or I'll do it and then you do it. I'm over here with a bone stock Honda Civic and you're running <laughs> a Hellcat with a with a, with a a good supercharger and a nitrous kit. Just cause I got a loud exhaust doesn't mean I got the horsepower, okay? This man over here, how many Vorons have you built? Yes. Okay, yeah, yes. I have barely built one. I'm cheating, I'm just gonna go ahead and bend the belt a little bit to help myself out yeah. on this. All right, get your stopwatch out. You, you, you can time me too, but we'll put it on the screen for everybody. Ready, set. Go. It's too many threads. Uh, it's too much screwing. We got, oh, what? Okay, we got the thing. I gotta massage the belt, massage the belt. Yes, put it through, it comes up. Oh, you got lucky. Grab it. Once we have that, bend the belt the other way to help yourself out. Okay, it goes in and around. Loop, de loop and pull. Oh. Hold on, hold on, and now your shoes are looking, hold on, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, time. So I, I, I spotted 30. you about a second, you're at 34 seconds. Okay, 34 seconds. My turn? 
I'll get that ex <laughs> I need all the help I can get. Uh, I don't, do I have a stopwatch on this? I don't know, hold on. We'll use yours again. We use mine? Yep. Okay, we're ready? ready? He's like moving extra slow to make me feel good. Oh no, no he is not. <laughs> All the threads, all the threads, all the threads, all the threads, all the threads. Ah! A whole 10 seconds faster, 23 <laughs> seconds, which I That's mean- That's not bad. I've done this- A couple of times. A couple. A couple of times. At least a couple. For those that are wondering <laughs> what the heck is all this about, if you don't know, the Voron Trident is very much Steve's baby. And it is the first, it's the first Voron that I've attempted to build at this point. I still got to get it running fast, but it is printing. This was particularly a sore spot for me. The belt routing was uh, not the easiest, so to say, but it is easier now, now that I do understand it. it. And yep. hilariously, if there was just a GIF showing how to do that in uh, on the online instructions, man. There is now, you can clip it. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> see, we can do that. And then we can make an official request to the Voron manual. This purple is really nice too. Isn't it? I need, I need a that purple. That is an LDO frame. I need a purple frame yeah. in my life. My first trident is from those frame pieces. Wait, the so- The development trident. This is from the first trident. Yeah. That's some history to this. <laughs> that is super cool. Steve, thank you for putting this together so no that uh, you can both make me feel much smarter and more dumb in the At process. At the same time. Yeah. yeah. I don't know how that works. Guys, if you do want to see more of Steve on the channel, let me know in those comments and maybe we'll get him on a podcast. We will probably have to edit the time because normally we run into your show. We have a lot more coverage here at 3D Printopia 2024, but this was just one that was supposed to be a joke, turned into a real thing. And we both said, let's do it on let's camera it. because it is absolutely awesome. Stay tuned for more. That is all we have for you all today. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. I, they're supposed to be doing that. Stay safe out there. Don't forget to call your loved ones. And as always, keep making awesome. Yes! I didn't even tell him. <laughs> I didn't even tell him. <laughs> See you later. <laughs>